Protecting the UK from falling skies is a serious business, especially considering one of the biggest bits of space junk to fall to Earth was a 260 kilogram rocket fuel tank. That's roughly the size of a motorbike. Just imagine the devastation that could cause. So when we heard that the fifth automated transfer vehicle, or ATV-5, was carrying supplies to the International Space Station, we thought observing its final orbit and return journey would be a great opportunity to gather new data. ATV-5 was already loaded with instruments to capture data about its re-entry to the Earth's atmosphere. But we worked with our defence and space partners to add extra space situational awareness experiments to the project. We showed that radar systems in the UK could cue electro-optical sensors on the other side of the world, which meant we could also use them to observe ATV-5 in space, even when the re-entry plans changed at the last minute. The kit we used to observe re-entry was like the cameras amateur astronomers use. In fact, hobbyists were able to take some awesome images using the queuing data. The observations gave us a unique chance to study the behaviour of objects in space travelling at 10,000 miles per hour. Not the kind of thing you get to test every day. This data has proved vital in helping us to improve the UK space security. And we're also using it to understand how objects like rockets, satellites and missiles could behave in space helping us to protect the UK even more. Taking a 360 view of defence, even in space. Now that's unexpected science. <laughs>